So following the two Monsters Inc. leaks over the past week, we now have a major leak revealing what appears to be a large amount of the worlds in Kingdom Hearts 3. That's right, we have had a world list leak for Kingdom Hearts 3. Now the list isn't complete, I'm going to estimate it to be about half the worlds because total um, we now have a list of 12 worlds, so I'm thinking that's about half. Now personally I do think that this list is legit. Uh, none of the worlds on the list are really a surprise or anything. Um, the majority were either already announced or were, to me, what would seem like common sense or just expected to be in the game anyway. Um, so keep in mind that the list is not finished, so there are going to be more worlds than just what's on this list. Now, if you don't want to know anything about them, then um, I don't really know what you're doing here, to be honest, but... Uh, if you did click here anyway, then just know that this is your chance to not be spoiled about this potential uh, world list. Um, now, if you're here, and you're still here, well then, let's get into the list. Now, um, as I said, uh, most of these worlds we already knew about, like Olympus or Galaxy Toys, or the Kingdom of Corona from um, Tangled. Uh, the same thing for Twilight Town, The Land of Departure, Mysterious Tower, and uh, San Francisco. We've seen all of these worlds at some point within the promotional um, stuff for the game, either in a trailer or in the art that more releases. Um, and so those worlds, they're just, um, those aren't important. Those are the seven that don't matter. We already know about them. However, there are five new worlds that we did not have any knowledge of before. But like I said, these aren't really a surprise. Uh, now those worlds are Radiant Garden in the Hundred Acre Wood, Arendelle, Disney Castle, and Monstropolis from Monsters, Inc. Now, I mean, is anyone really surprised to have a frozen world in Kingdom Hearts 3? I mean, honestly. I mean, you just, you can't be surprised by that. There's just no way. I mean, honestly, I, I thought that was one of the almost obvious worlds that was going to be in Kingdom Hearts 3 myself. Uh, I'm not really surprised about that one. Um, as far as Radiant Garden and the Hundred Acre Wood, I mean, they're always showing up. I mean, they're always there. Um, so those two I'm not surprised over. Uh, Monstropolis, however, I would be surprised about if we didn't have two leaks and 13 screenshots already. Um, and then the Disney Castle, not really surprised about that one either myself. I mean, we've been there a few times before. Um, and I would think it would be a little bit weird if we didn't go there, as a matter of fact. So, you know, it is Mickey's home, it's Doll and Goofy and, you know, all of our, uh, gang's home. So, you know, I think it would be, uh, more proper that it did show up than if it didn't. So, um, those are all the worlds. Um, so yeah, like I said, 12 worlds, I think that's about half. I think that personally, I'm expecting somewhere between 20 and 24 worlds total, but um, I wouldn't be surprised. Maybe a little bit more, maybe a little less, but that's about where I'm at, 20 to 24. But uh, what do you think? Do you think this list is legit? Um, and how many worlds do you actually expect to be uh, within Kingdom Hearts 3? Um, let me know below, and I'll see you guys next time.